Same spot you're throwing, kind of where that water's a little calmer. Uh, about 15, 16. He's a male, he's grunting. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> he left. Say goodbye. All right, guys, today we're throwing the old Saw Strong Mulligan. It's a dimpled bait fish pattern and some trout out here doing that seems to be like a little slick right over there and that's where i'm getting most of the bites so just throwing it out kind of popping working it over the top of the grass that's where i'm getting the bites i was right there on the edge of that slick Red. Yep. Yeah, just right there at the edge. <laughs> Alright guys, right here on the Salt Strong Mulligan. Beautiful tail, look at that. Beautiful red tail. Seventeen, eighteen. All right, buddy. We will let you go. There it is. Really good to imitate these bait fish that we keep seeing. A lot of bait out here. Seems to be mullet. So, trying to imitate that. See if we can't get him to bite. There's one. Ooh, that's a better one. That was like 15 feet in front of me, Dad. So there's a little pocket there. Oh, that was a red. That's a red. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to go between my legs. Come on, buddy. Uh, this is on an eighth ounce. Little paddle tail. This is the slam shady color. It's yeah, uh, pretty pearl, but it's got silver and gold fleck in it. Ooh, salty head stuck in good. All right, guys, pretty little red. We'll let him go. Right, guys a little trout here and I got him good right in the eyeball Ooh, be good there we go yeah he's kind of close Aaron so I'm gonna let him go he's like 15 on the number
What is up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Fishkin Milligan. We launched out of Arroyo City. We decided to go north. I'm out here with my dad, his friend, David Carruthers, and we are with Captain Aaron Canul. Blue Line Outdoor Adventures, and it's a beautiful day out here throwing some murky water rods. We got some brand new rods that are not even out on the market yet. We'll be showing you guys those rods here in a sec. Man, it's a few days before the expo. Hopefully I can get this video out. And uh, man, just good to be out here. Haven't been out here on the water in a minute. It is nice being out here. All right, let's see if we can't catch a few today. The water temp's about 84 degrees. Air temp's a little bit higher than that. Nice and hot today. Not much wind. Hopefully the wind pick up here a little bit. Oxygenate the water and shoot, oxygenate us because we're getting hot already. There's another one. Dude, my drag was so loose. I tried to thumb it <laughs> to get tension. Yeah, I just slipped. This is the brand new Featherlight series. This thing right here is 2.4 ounces. This reel is 4.9 ounces. And with line and everything on there, you're looking at just under eight ounces from the Murky Water Rod Company. This is crazy. This is so light, man. Such a feather. They will be available at the expo. So if I get this video out before the expo, you guys need to go check it out. There it is. There it is. Reel it in, reel it in. There we go. There we go. Ugh. I'll get it for you. Good one. It's a good trout. Come on. Come on. There you go. Good one. Oh, isn't it crazy those boats went by us and those fish weren't even bothered? Like, I don't even care. Maybe. Could have. There we go. <laughs> oh, it came off. Ah. <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, that's a good trout, brother. That's a good trout. As soon as it hit the water, too. He's not happy. He's not happy. Come on, brother. That was a trout that just got next to you. I feel like Wayne Davis over here. You got a good point about, like, you want to fish. Let that fish do what it's going to do. Yeah. You know? Sure. You yeah. What's up guys? Just switch spots. Still have the feather light on. Man, I'll tell you what, this thing is awesome. I'm casting one-handed like it's my job. And I'm walking in here, not tired. It's great. Got it paired up with the custom light, and this is uh, Cortland Master Braid. I believe this is 10 pound test. And then I have a little floor carbon leader, and then I got it with a salty head and a TNT. And what I'm doing is, it's like super grassy as y'all can tell, right? See that? Super grassy. And this thing, man, I'll tell you what, it just goes in the grass, doesn't get hung up, pop it up, pop it up. And this thing is sick right here. Have you tried the Los Pescadores coffee yet or no? Oh, it's amazing. It's good, right? The double haul, it's a pour over? Yeah, I like the pour over. Dude. I, I do the Laguna Madre and then the Ethiopian blend. Oh, okay. Yeah. I just couldn't pass those reds, dude. Mm-hmm. I, I had to turn around for them. Yeah. 
Never leave a red behind. <laughs> Guys, good red fish for uh, this is uh, the elder fish again, Milligan. Yeah, <laughs> we have a, somebody's got to teach the new fish. I know we got a uh, we left Mrs. Fish again at home and then we brought the older, wiser fish again, and he's slaying today. Beautiful fish, look at that! Beautiful fish, blue line outdoor adventures. Aaron Canoe, book him up. Book him up quick before he's gone. There it is. That's the big boy. Jeez, y'all can't see it, but that's a smile under that mask there. <laughs> oh, that's a big boy. <laughs> he hit that, exactly. That's why you don't have to say, oh, is it a trout or a red? I, I don't know. Captain Canoe to the rescue, boys and girls. Sometimes you give it another hook set. Just pull back and give it a good hook set. There you go. Make sure it's stuck in there good. That's a good one, though. <laughs> He's a good boy. Ooh -wee. He's hooked good. He's hooked good, brother. Scooped him up. Let's go. <laughs> good one, dude. I told him, I said, now you check if that one's over 28. <laughs> the cool thing about fishing with Captain Canoe guys is you get to try out some murky water rods. So my dad showed up today with no rod, no reel, and he's got them covered. He's got some really nice reels and rods. It's, it's weird. The bigger they get, the further out the blue gets, like in the, wow. in the tail. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. There, Mr. Milligan. Oh, there it goes. Adios. Good deal. Good job, team. Yeah. On the feather light. Yes, sir. Dude, my drag wouldn't start for whatever reason. It was like stuck for a little bit. I was like, oh my uh, yeah, God, oh my God, good. oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Finally got it broke in with a little red today. Good one. He's a good boy. Oh, yeah. Nice. Just when I put it on there, too. There you go. Nice. It's a smaller red, too. Look at the tail. Look how much more blue it's got. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. One, two. This is hilarious, bro. <laughs> oh, this is too funny. Guys, we're taking pictures, and he's over there hooking up. That's a trout. This is a red. A minute ago, a flounder. He's gonna be eaten. Thank you, baby, for letting me borrow your stringer. Black and gold, brother. Well, guys, another red on the feather light. This is gonna be available at the expo. Woo! <laughs> he ain't ready yet. Uh, the latest offering for murky water rods if you guys are interested be sure to go out to the expo july 19th through the 21st and uh they're going to be bringing over a hundred rods so you guys can pick and choose what you like i enjoy this feather light <laughs> with this custom light everything light even light colors light tan my favorite color it's not 
Bacio, we'll see.